Portland's youngest activists gathered together today for climate change. Now, the rally is in support of a federal court case involving 21 youth plaintiffs. Fox 12's Brenna Kelly is in studio now with more. Brenna? Well, the climate lawsuit Juliana v. U.S. filed in 2015 revolves around 21 young people suing the federal government. They range in age from 11 years old to 22 and claim the government violated their constitutional rights by contributing to climate change. The trial was scheduled to begin today at a federal courthouse in Eugene, so dozens of rallies are happening around the country in support of it. My name is Annika Main. I'm a senior at Franklin High School. Here locally, a high school senior organizing a rally, both in support of their 21 young peers and in response to a new climate report released by the United Nations on climate change. Scientists say big changes need to happen by 2030 to avoid the worst effects. Our winters are becoming more like spring. We see smog in the air constantly. You just can't, you can't put that on any other issue. It is climate change. It is real. The lawsuit claims government officials have known for more than 50 years that carbon pollution was causing climate change. They say policies on oil and gas deprive young people of life, liberty and property. It is nearly 2019 and no action seems to be taken. Organizers say they're here to prove adults wrong, that kids really can make a difference. But all of you here today show that there is a strong belief in youth power and climate activism. We powerful. It's really empowering to see, you know, my peers care about something. The trial again scheduled to start today was put on hold as the Supreme Court decides whether it should move forward. In studio, Brenna Kelly, Fox 12 Oregon.